course. Well, first of all, Ali, thank you very much. And thank you to Army Recognition for the opportunity. My name is Harry Dawson. I'm the Director for International Sales, focused on the Middle East and North Africa region. Uh, EDGE is the uh, large defense conglomerate of advanced technology from the UAE. It's uh, in its fifth year at the moment, so it's a, a culmination of the long-standing many decades of manufacturing maturity from the UAE, all under one banner. It's a state-owned organization, uh, and as I say, we're in our fifth year. It's our first attendance here at Eurosatori, and it's a pleasure to be here. It's a great opportunity for us to showcase on the stand at the moment, you'll see over 50 of our products represented here across 35 entities that we have within the EDGE group. There are five core clusters, and within those there are 35 entities. 50 of those products are represented here today. It's a non-exhaustive showcase of what we have, uh, but across sea, air, and, and, and land, obviously. So here you'll have, as we go through, a coverage of our secu secure communications capabilities with our handset here called CATIM, uh, and also our gateways. Through here, Alain, this is one of the uh, more recent features that Edge has within our portfolio. It's called X Range. So it's our dedicated island. It's about an hour's drive from Abu Dhabi in the capital of the UAE. And here we have the capability to demonstrate and also trial, test, and evaluate air, land, and sea on our own private dedicated island. But we do this from a collaborative perspective as well. So we work with our international partners, both on the commercial and end user perspective, to bring their technology and kit here to test either ours or, or their own in that function. And so you can see here, Alain, as part of uh, Lahab as our organization, we have all the small caliber light ammunition, LLA, and then we have all Lahab Defense Systems, which is our medium to larger caliber. That covers, as you can see, through the 20 millimeter and 60 millimeter mortars, uh, through to the 155s and family of 120s as well. In the UAE, we also manufacture uh, the Mark 80 uh, family of bombs also, which we provide the precision kits on that we spoke about. So this is all 100% manufactured at our facility in the UAE called Tawaz and Industrial Park. NIMA is a long-standing uh, entity in the UAE uh, that now sits within the EDGE family, uh, manufacturing a whole range of uh, armored personnel carriers. Uh, from what you see here, the Ashban Mark II, uh, right through to the various other smaller models that we have here, because we can't bring them all, obviously, uh, long range and uh, long range SOV, LRSOV vehicle. We provide 6x6, 4x4 and 8x8 vehicles within the family of NIMA. Once again, from the ground up, all UAE IP and all manufactured at our facility at Tawaz and Industrial Park. EDGE's three core components of focus at the moment are electronic warfare, smart weaponry and autonomy. So autonomy is a big driver for us and ADASI being, the, being the, uh, the, the, the jewel in the crown, if you will. So we have a full range of platforms here. Some of the, the, the uh, models that you'll see are obviously miniaturized versions because we can't bring everything again. But you see everything from the Garmusha uh, through to the air truck, which is a logistic support uh, aircraft, uh, right through to our loitering munitions family. Uh, here you'll see the QX3 in the background there, through to QX2 and then QX1. So these are the uh, VTOL loitering munitions that we provide, QX1 being the kamikaze drone within that, and then the deployable and return to home uh, capabilities. We also have longer range strike loitering munitions in the background, Shadow 25 and Shadow 50, respectively having a 50 kilogram warhead or a 25 kilogram warhead, uh, right through to some future force development programs as an unmanned combat aircraft, such as Janaya. So what we're doing here is we're representing what we're currently producing in the UAE and manufacturing at our facilities at TIP, as well as what we're working on in terms of what the future looks like for EDGE in unmanned uh, aerial vehicles. So Anavia was an organization that we acquired as part of our uh, large spree of acquisitions over the last 24, to, uh, 24 months. Anavia from Switzerland. Um, this is a fantastic VTOL capability, often used for maritime or ground-based uh, operations. Um, we also made the acquisition of an organization called Milrem from Estonia, which manufactured the UGVs, okay, which are, combat, again, combat-proven uh, uh, capability. And these are the unmanned ground vehicles. Uh, and and Avia is a, a major uh, play for us at the moment, particularly whilst we're here representing EDGE in, in Europe. So here, Ali, we have uh, um, our Rash uh, family as well. So what we're doing is we're allowing the end users to take inventory that they already have, let's say in the form of the 60 millimeter mortars, and then applying a kit to that to allow for precision guided munitions and also taking dumb bombs and, and making them smart with that glided capability to extend that range significantly. We provide the same kits as well to the Mark 80 family of bombs under what we call our Thunder family. Uh, and then we also provide the, the full up round in, in the form of a Desert Sting, Desert Sting 16, which has the fantastic back range capability. So these precision strike assets that we're, we're, we're manufacturing in the UAE are typically uh, within the Desert Sting family for light attack aircraft uh, and also unmanned assets. 
We also have larger uh, strike capabilities, kits for the Mark 80 family of bombs under our company Altaric, which again manufacture these sets in the UAE, uh, and that more for the fighter jets to really extend that range to that 100 plus, 120 kilometer uh, range. So one of the key, key, key messages I'd like to focus on is that electronic warfare, smart weaponry and autonomous systems, that, that, that's our key focus. And what we're able to do as Edge Group is bring real agility to bringing uh, very advanced technology quickly to the customer within the regions that we focus on. And one of the advantages that we'll have is that we're not restricted by ITAR. And what that means is that with the IP of sole development within the UAE, we produce and manufacture to our customers' needs. So we are able to move very quickly to provide them with capabilities, again, across the electronic warfare, autonomous or smart weaponry space, as well as tr more traditional defense uh, articles and as assets as well. Thank you so much. All right, thank you.